St. Augustine now could a carousel come back to St. Augustine. It's looking like it, folks. For 25 years, the carousel just delighted families in town. My kids love, oh my gosh, we rode that over and over. My daughter loved this horse named Petey. We would always go down there. A lot of folks like us, so sad when it left. So Jessica Clark tonight is reporting what is in the works that could put a carousel in the same park where the old one was for all those years. And this is always one of my favorite stops with my grandchildren. And this stop now just has a concrete pad and a patch of grass where a carousel once stood. For 25 years, a carousel swirled around in Davenport Park in St. Augustine, drawing in families and children. It was the biggest bargain in America, one dollar for a ride. <laughs> and Matoza loved it. Uh, so when the uh, carousel left us, it was a uh, sad day for my grandchildren. A sad day for many people on the First Coast when the owner's family moved the carousel to South Florida in 2019. Now comes this man, J.W. Brinkley of Jacksonville, who spoke to St. Augustine City Commissioners Monday. My children and my grandchildren have enjoyed the carousel. He wants to lease space in that same park and put a new carousel there. And all of it concerns young people and the enrichment of the community. We're not looking at this as a profit center or a business venture. I'm looking at something that long term that a trust would be set up and it would never leave St. Augustine. People at the park Tuesday liked that plan for the most part. Think about I that. think it's a good idea. I think they would love it. I bring them. Yeah, I would. Yeah. Since the carousel left this park, this intersection has really been built out. This is where May and San Marco and San Carlos all connect in a roundabout type situation. And some people wonder, uh, with this new and sometimes tricky intersection to maneuver, is a carousel the best idea for this spot? City leaders are simply considering the plan right now. Along with the volume of the carousel's music, city leaders may also rein in the hours of operation. But for the most part, I think it would be great. Folks in St. Augustine would love to see the comeback of a carousel. Let's okay. bring it back okay. so that my great-grandchildren will have a chance to ride it. Yeah. In St. Augustine, Jessica Clark, First Coast News on your side.